Hi everyone, welcome to Prince Ken's World. Here with me are the most important hard copies of the documents you need to apply for any visa. So I'm going to show you guys one by one so that whenever you are applying for your visa, you will not be confused. So stay tuned, okay? Please make sure you are following my videos because what I share here is valid and important updates. And do not forget to share this video, okay? Now, the first document you need to apply for any visa is your passport your international passport very very important you need a valid international passport before you can talk about applying for any visa okay your passport is very important take note your passport the next document you need is your account statement your account statement very very important for instance if you are traveling for tourism and your tourism duration will not last more than three months you need at least three million for three months tourism okay but if you are traveling with student visa or you want to apply for student visa my dear you need at least five million in your account okay five million some countries might even ask for 10 million in your account statement okay so it depends on the country you are going to take note the third document you need is your travel insurance okay your travel insurance okay see it here your travel insurance this insurance covers your medical expenses your emergency medical evacuation in case of illness or accident your repatriation of mortal remains your repatriation after treatment and many more okay your travel insurance very very important take note now the fourth one is your police report your police report is very very important so before you can apply for any visa you have to make sure that you have gotten your police report and you get your police report from any police headquarters okay so this police report is very very important so make sure you get it before you can think about applying for visa this police report is very important very important look at it here i hope you have seen it look at it here this is called police report now listen before you can apply for your visa you have to bring what they call relator of introduction from your business or your company relator of introduction very important it says greetings from the management at this instance we are pleased to introduce mr your name as our industrial engineer you know so the company has to introduce you as their worker okay if you are the one sponsoring yourself you have to bring a letter of reintroduction from where you are working okay but if you are self-employed you have to bring a letter of introduction from your company or your business okay very important what if someone is sponsoring you that person need to bring a relator of introduction where he or she is working very important take note of this this document is also important they call it monthly payment slip okay it is an overall evidence of your salary where you are working it shows your overall payment your basic salary housing allowance your transportation allowance your me allowance utility welfare and etc but if you are self-employed you can skip this monthly payment slip okay take note the next important document you need is your attestation of birth letter from the national population commission very important look at it here from the national population commission so you have to get this before you can apply for any visa take note of this if someone is sponsoring you you need an affidavit of sponsorship from that person very important see it here an affidavit of sponsorship from your sponsor take note before i forget you need your medical certificate see it here your medical certificate from a federal medical center very important this is your visa form look at it your visa form okay 
We call this the saffron. Look at it. I hope you are seeing it. For those that want to apply for admission for any school in abroad, this document is called Admission Acceptance Letter and Confirmation of Accommodation. You need this. If you want to apply for student visa, you need this document. Very important. Without this, they will not give you the visa. Now, again, this stamp you are seeing here, they call it legalization, okay? So before you can apply for any visa, you must make sure that you have legalized all your documents in the embassy. So as you have seen this, make sure you share this video. And don't forget to follow up for more important and valid updates. Stay tuned.